Now then, folks, what we're going to try to do today is we're going to try to play Auld Lang Syne using this sheet and our iPad using the app GarageBand. Here we are. So if I press GarageBand, we open up to this. We need to scroll along until you find the keyboard. It might already be there. And we press keyboard. And then before we start playing any tunes, we need to do a little bit of setting up um, of the app. So first of all, we need to make sure that we're using the smallest possible keyboard we can. So this little button here, if you've been messing around with it, it might have changed to different sizes of keyboard. Or you may even have pressed this one where we have two keyboards. So first of all, we need to make sure that we only have one keyboard and that it is the smallest keyboard. There we go. Now then, the next thing we need to do is we need to find C3. I've got C2 at the bottom here. Again, if you've messed around, the C3 might be way up here or way down here. We need to make sure the C3 is here, first of all, but then we're going to move it from there to here, to the second note here. So in order to do that, we have to toggle this switch, glissando or scroll. Glissando or scroll. So we need to have it on scroll, and we take a hold of C3 and we pull it all the way down till it becomes the second note on the keyboard. Perfect. Now we need to press that button again so that it goes back to glissando. That way, when you pull it, it doesn't pull the note. Instead, it plays a lovely glissando. Okay. Now, the next thing to do before we bring the sheet up is we need to make sure that the brightness is all the way up. So, do you see what I did? Pull this down. Here's the brightness. All the way up. Right. Then, when you pull the sheet over, the keyboard will shine through the paper. Isn't that clever? Now... We've set the keyboard up this way so that the three black notes are exactly in the middle, here and here. So we need to match up this exactly. Now you might notice that I've put some pieces of blue tack down the bottom here just to hold my sheet in place once I do finally get it in the right place. So here we go. One, two, three. I think that's good enough. Hold it down and press the blue tack there we go now we're ready to play the tune now basically we're just going to follow these notes here and match them up with the notes that are written on here and um, you'll notice that some of them are blue these are the higher notes up here the black ones are lower and um, the other thing to notice is we have these little lines here some of them are longer than others and here, that just means we're going to hold those notes a little bit longer. But um, I'm guessing you probably will know this tune, so your ear will tell you how long to hang on to these notes. So, here we go. We're going to start here, and we're just going to use one finger just now um, and follow the notes. There we are. Happy New Year, everybody. Have fun with that, and we'll see you again for another tune.
another time. Bye for now.